Only a short time ago, Amelia Earhart checked over every detail of her $80,000 flying laboratory in preparation for her round-the-world flight. This was to have been her greatest achievement, a sky dash of 28,000 miles. With her husband, George Palmer Putnam on right, she discussed the hazardous course which had been plotted for her by Fred Noonan, the navigator who embarked with Miss Earhart upon this great flight, a flight which was to have marked her retirement to aeronautical research. Then to a waiting world came news of disaster as the plane failed to reach tiny Howland Island in mid-Pacific. A British freighter, the Coast Guard and the Navy sped to the search. The battleship Colorado steaming out from Honolulu under forced draft. From California, the aircraft carrier Lexington with 3,000 men and 72 planes aboard races into the distant Pacific to join the greatest searching party in the history of aviation. 